Hello everyone and welcome to Roller Coaster Tycoon 3 Part 6. Last week we finished the sci-fi world that was very, very good because the sci-fi world was not easy to build. Um, I need to make sure that this entire coaster is on the gray. So, now it's done! Okay, so let's get started on the spooky world. It actually probably won't be that spooky, but I will do my best to make it as spooky as spooky can get. First of all, these people are coming over here even though that even though they know that there is nothing at all here. So I need to add something. I'm gonna go to spooky themed right over here, right when you enter. There will be a spider top spinner right there, right when you get into this, I mean, sorry, gallows swing, I mispronounced, I didn't mispronounce it, I meant to say gallows swing, but you know what I mean, okay, so this path is spooky enough, what about this spooky entrance, mm. okay, I'm gonna open that up, and then, just gonna what uh, what do I have to do? Forgot what I have to do. Um, it's okay, I'll do it later. I feel like I really need to do something. But I think it's good. Okay. So we need at least one roller coaster here, because you know it's roller coaster tycoon three. So yeah, we need roller coasters. So what are we going to do for our roller coaster? And that is the question of the next few minutes. And I'm going to add in some more sugar pines, because those look spooky. They look kind of spooky. And I like how the grass is a little bit different. Um, yeah. So this will go nice. Um, there we go. That looks good. And, no, uh, my mouse is going weird. Okay get that out of the way same with that and then what should I build I'll build some gentle rides they have to be spooky wait I have like no room here oh geez I think I might have made a mistake um hmm. I think I got this uh let me go here Four by four, and then go back there, and go back up. There we go. So now if I go to Junior Ride's Monster Ride, I should just be able to put it right there. Life hacks, or more like game hacks, because this is not real life. Sadly, I wish that this was a real park, because, I mean, it won Best Sci-Fi Scenery, and I totally agree. I mean, look at how ugly that building is. I am not proud at all of this building, but you know what? People are liking the food, and that's what's important. So I'm gonna go back over to the spooky world. It, it's like a it's it's a huge change between the sci-fi world, the generic area, the water park, and the spooky world. There's a huge difference between all of the worlds. Um. I don't know what happened, but just like now I completely randomly had this random gap of no talking. So you're going to see a very awkward cut in the middle of this. And it, it, it it's going to be weird. Sorry about that. I don't know what happened. Okay, I'm going to put a spooky wheel at the end of the path. Because wheels are spooky. Yes, they are. Wheels are... It depends on the wheel. Um, it really does actually depend on the wheel on how spooky it is. I'll put a spider top spinner right there. And then I'll go like that, that. This is going to be beautiful. It will be the best spooky world you have ever seen. And chances are I'll be able to actually finish it in this episode because it's tiny. It is a very small, spooky world. It's like, 
it's like miniature miniature oh no come on oh that's the only way I can fit it which sucks because I can't fit it um gonna have to delete the ghost house ride I think that first I'm gonna build my coaster um yeah I'm gonna build the coaster first because um it'll be hard to build around it so I'm gonna go to here roller coasters and I'm gonna go to what will I build I'll just make a basic looping coaster and I'm gonna make it red rails red rails no red rails and then black everything else red rails and then black everything else there we go okay I'll raise it up a little bit that's like one of the tiniest stations on any coaster so I'm gonna make it longer a good height and then I'm gonna have to make it drop and then turn around small helix that works and then woo! yeah it's the best roller coaster on the planet that's not true I wish though so. I'm gonna make it a vertical drop that'll be fun I'll fix that trench, I guess. I guess I kind of have to fix the trench. There we go. Everything's good. Everything's very good. Everything looks great. Everything looks like it might actually go off well. Sounds like I'm like about to do an experiment on reality TV. Just like, I don't think this will work. And then something amazing happens, which causes for celebration. I feel like I really should have made this a bigger world. Like actually, much bigger. But I made it like mini. That's going to be a problem. Um, hmm. Put an S. I can't do that. I'll have it do those like fun little twisty turny airtime hills. No, you have to go like that. Nope, wrong way. Uh do this no um there we go I've got this okay and then into the station is one of the shortest coasters I've made on this game because well I have like 20 feet of space to do it in it doesn't look very pretty no it doesn't look pretty it looks scary forget I ever said that it's not scary it's not good it isn't scary it isn't good. and it's gotta be scary
I'm gonna close it down, and then I'm gonna make the path go down there, and then the same thing over here. I'm gonna open that up. Woo! People are going to love this rock bark. People are gonna love it. We already have a hundred percent guest satisfaction. I think. I don't know. Let's check and see our guest satisfaction ratings. Guests, ah, uh, Adrienne and Alex are sad. That's not good. A lot of people are sad. Why is everyone so sad? I can see why you would be sad in this pool complex, because it has, like, more density than, like, a densely packed city. I don't know what I was going to say, and I knew it wouldn't work, so I didn't say it. You guys can all thank me. Okay, that's going to go right there. Ooh, spooky. It's very ghost house like. Wait, can I get it? So it's like no. No, uh, like that, and then I can go like that. There we go. Those look pretty. I'm gonna open up Ghost House Ride One, and then I th I I definitely need another ride. I don't know what I need. Are there any gentle rides I don't have? I have the mermaids. What about thrill rides? Okay, you know what? I thought I didn't have enough space, but apparently it, I have more than enough. I'm not using this for anything. I'm gonna make like a little kid's mini... I don't know. Uh... Guess I'll make... Um... A launched free fall, because the launch will be like... Just like a few miles an hour. Oh no, I have to make a top. There we go. Okay, I've got this. And then launch speed. I'm gonna make it. Um, I can't go any lower. Okay, let's test this out and see if it goes flying over. Yep, I saw that coming. It's about to explode. That's gonna be a major problem. Okay. There we go, I'm gonna make it go up one more higher. Cause as you can see, it barely crested over the top. Okay, let's see this. Our kids drop tower, test two. Nailed it, okay. And then number of circuits, two. I'm gonna make it two circuits. Woo! Yeah! Three circuits this time. We're gonna go three and see how well that works. Woo! I have two drop towers in my park. Bet you've never seen that before. Okay, that works. What's its excitement rating? Oh my god, it's a kid's ride. Calm down, it's not that insane. Okay, I need to make it a drac entrance and a drac exit of Dracula okay and then I'm gonna go to cars I'm gonna make them not rainbowed color and make them scary colors very scary colors Ooh, those are scary colors I have to do the same things on these notice how all of the worlds I've made the two main colors are black and gray actually look everything here is black or gray and everything here is black or gray. And then everything's here like bright colors. You could probably make like a rainbow out of this. There's your red, your green, your yellow, your blue, your white, your thing, your other thing. Yeah. This is a very, very pretty spooky area, and, God, I don't want to have this finished in one day, but I'm not going to say it is. I'm going to do something. I guess it's done. Wow. We finished this in one day. Let's celebrate 
by putting down some pine trees. What a celebration and what a way to end off the spooky world, the mini, absolutely tiny spooky world that I think I made too small. I don't think I made it too small. I know I made it too small, but at least now we've had multiple episodes in a row of roller coaster build. Ooh, I'm making it a spookier entrance. Maybe, I don't know, if I can add anything, I will. But I honestly don't think I need anything to make this place spooky. I do need some spooky snacks, and that's what I'm gonna do right now. That's all I need, I just need spooky snacks. That's what I'm gonna call the food court, spooky snacks. Sounds like something that Tom Haverford would say. Actually, if you've seen Parks and Rec, spooky snacks. Um, I need it to be spooky, because, oh, pumpkin pie. Very, very, very terrifying. I'm awfully scared of pumpkin pie. That's bound to give a very, very young child a heart attack. I'm going to make some witches hats, because witches are spooky. Oh, it's laughing. It's, it's not really laughing as much as trying to open a pickle jar. That's much hard, that's much. And then, you know, toilets. You gotta have spooky toilets. I mean, normally I have you guys name things, but spooky toilets. Sometimes bathroom trips are absolutely terrifying. You don't know what is on those flush things. You don't know what's on the seats, and you don't know what's on the sink. Just as scary as knowing that the dirtiest thing in the restaurant is the menu. So, yeah. That is our spooky world in 30 minutes. Which I didn't expect. Okay, I almost fixed the terrain. I just need to do some finishing touches. And, no, nope. once, I, once I do this, we have officially finished the spooky world in one episode. Oh, we won best sci-fi scenery again. Okay, ready? Three, two, one. Woo, we're done with the spooky world! That is a success. So, thank you for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you next time.